Hey guys, this is Death Knight IX, and welcome back to another episode of Ride of Icarus. So today, um, I'm gonna talk about the new Blacksmith event that just came out again. Um, many, many of you may wonder, how do I get this guy? How do I start? Is he worth it? What's the process of crafting it? And what's, what do they do to get the materials to craft these things? Well, today, I'm gonna show you how. So first off, when you first start, you can be like, so where is this guy? Let me show you where he is. So when you go to Hakan's Crossing, you go to Noble Gates, some guy will just be standing there in the middle of Noble Gates in the hallway, like this. Well, he's not there because I already found him. And he's gonna be like, help! Please help me. Someone's lost. And it's your mission to save the damsel in distress. But... Uh, this one's not so pretty and then Once you get the mission you have to go to on top of the map of Hakana's Crossing and go to the P PvP portal for Badlands. Please don't enter it It's, it's he's in crossing not not the Badlands. and you have to go to this area right here like a okay, circles and He's gonna be chilling there And then you have to talk to him. Yeah, he's a uh Introvert, so you have to talk to him. And after you talk to him, you have to escort him all the way down to the castle. It may take 10 minutes, um, the max. So, but he's pretty much. Be, he, you don't have to do this again. You just have to suffer for 10 minutes. Yeah. Thanks for love. And once you reach to the destination, he asks you. He'll go to Artisan Square and behind everyone else give you some missions. There's a blue one and there's a bunch of green ones. So as you can see here, the blue ones are this basic crafting stuff. Um yeah. And then the green ones are the daily missions. Um tier one is the most easiest is McTamin the Bull. By the way, these are all Scarlet Harbor stuff, so you have to be geared, you have to have a party carry you to, to you know finish the boss that you need. Um and please pick the tier that you can handle. Don't pick the highest tier like tier four like me, crack this the first time ever because we got obliterated and we did not get the mission done. It only took a week to find the mechanics and kill them but please don't be like me just do what you can um t1 is easiest to you too a bit easy no a bit harder my bad t3 you know it's hard but you can do it and t9 i mean <laughs> what is it t9 i was thinking of boss 9 but t4 um if you can clear them good for you the higher the tier the better reward but if you can't clear boss 8 or boss 9 please don't pick tier 3 or 4 pick the easiest one so you get something rather than nothing so yeah you have a choice to pick either one of these tiers and you can only pick one of the tiers and then for the other daily missions you have to go to Hikane's Highlands in order to get this daily mission um, as you can see and then you have to go to Clawing Waste mission and then the Alcrat mission and then that's it you get all that's your daily missions sh daily mission on uh, the those three platforms the three maps and then you get the materials um daily so yeah it's a daily mission and also let me show you some other things so you can ask where to get the recipes well one of the recipes is you have to attain, you know, blah 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 up here, and then they give you another one. Oh, here's another Zell recipe. Um, yeah, so this is Zell recipe. You don't have to if you don't want to. It's only because, you know, Zell is half like hardy craft. Um, let me show you my achievements, <laughs> meaning all my failures. Um, yeah. A lot of these are failed. Yeah, it's that's why they have this other mission. Oh, it's a simple one. I, th I think it's guaranteed craft. 
the problem is you won't get the maxed transcending which is well I haven't get max but the ma it gives you 507 transcending automatically and it gives you two line of the um, dam the stats you have on your original outstation uh, weapon so for example if it had strength strength um, magic attack for some reason you'll only get the top two lines and you get automatically four slots um, the reason why people don't do this mission is because one the transcending is really hard um, even though it's hard to craft the transcending is worth it so you get that extra 2.5% uh, attack boost as you can see and the two lines above your weapon um, it will be transferred if you do the um, normal hard craft but I'm not saying you should not do it because if because having Zell plus 10 or plus no plus 7 to plus 15 is already better than 10 damage in plus 25 so if you don't want to wait and you want to craft go ahead be my guest and if you have the stones to temple from 7 to 15 go ahead you have a lot of DPS um, like hundreds more than Temujin so yeah if you want to go ahead if you want to wait go ahead it's up to you but you lose some stuff but you gain so much DPS but it's up to you anyways back to the craft um, so when you open it you have all these recipes and like what are these well it's from the daily missions you get these things called the in in inert chaos yeah I can tell in English um, yeah in the chaos and then you train it in for oh no mock 2 or mock whatever when you want or you can just use a loon um, don't mind my loon I can well if you're like me and broke you don't have a loon and you're like uh, I'll just stick to the daily mission that's fine that's fine um, if you ask no why is this in case you're wondering, I'm actually top in my uh, spire, and you're like, oh, why is the top Zerg and spire have no loon? Well, I can't spend it all on stuff for my collection. <laughs> and then you know, yeah, take goes my loon. Don't be like me, unless you wanna spend it all. Um, yeah, so you can use a loon or the daily crafting stuff to get it. After that, you have to do the daily missions to get more of these potions, and then you'll be able to craft. And it's under weapons. Um, I hate how Rise doesn't have the search bar. It's kind of annoying just scrolling, scrolling, and yeah. So these are the recipes. As you can see, you need uh, different kinds of chaos. Um, it's all from the daily mission, so don't worry about it. You just have to do it daily. Um, the only thing you have to worry about is getting the recipe for the previous. Um, the previous uh, mark or whatever sell knowledge thing is to get to the next one to craft. So for me, I have <laughs> one. <laughs> yeah, one. So I need to start crafting. And then after you get the previous one, start crafting. Um, I'm gonna guess it's the weapons um, It's ready to craft So yeah, that's pretty much it And if you wanna see how I do the missions um, Feel free to watch this And if you, you're done This is the end of the tutorial And yeah um, Hope you enjoy and Now for those who want to see me do the other missions um, Step by step I'm gonna have to speed run this And Talk to you later. By the way, um, you also get all attributes for the sacred dark essence. You get all the def overall defense for the Sonora Soul Stones, and you get overall attack for the Cell Marks. So yes, in the end, it is worth it. Um, it's worth doing it. <laughs>